Ladies and gentlemen, how is it going? It's your boy Crazy Craze and welcome to a Destiny 2 video. Now in this video we are going to be talking about the contact public event and how to make it heroic majority of the time that you do this. Now everything I say take it with a grain of salt because sometimes it will work and sometimes it will not. But every time I have tried it, which has been three or was it four times, I think it was four times that I tried doing this. Every time I did it, it worked 100% of the time. It got me to heroic. Now, let's get straight into this. How do we get the contact public event to heroic? Now, first things first. For those of you who don't know about the contact public event, make sure you have anti-barrier mod selected on a submachine gun or whatever gun you can put it onto. I think it's just submachine guns and like sidearms or something. But, as you can tell, I didn't have it on. I completely forgot. Big no move no worries I put it on now once you have it on you want to make sure it is if you have played gambit before you will kind of know how to do this you basically kill the blockers that are blocking you from putting the stuff in which are these assholes over here you kill them and as you can see they drop modes now when they drop modes you shoot them like normal you kill them and you bank the modes into the bank now how to get this 200% there's the things called blooms now how do you know where the blooms are if you look at the ship there's a beam of light showing from the ship as to where you need to go now when there is a beam of light showing where you need to go you go to that area don't just look at it don't think oh pretty light oh my god no you go to that area and there are going to be either two minotaurs, two centurions, there's going to be two big enemies and then there's also going to be a champion enemy so it can be an anti barrier or unstoppable like you just saw me kill. Now once you've killed him you can pick up the bloom. Now if you don't kill him quick enough they steal the bloom and in the bottom left hand corner on top of your super you will get a notification. A champion has stolen the bloom. You find the champion and you kill him. He normally just runs away so you can see where he's going. He's always next to the um, the area where the light was shining. Now, once you've killed him, you pick up the bloom and you come to the bank and you put in like normal. But, you press your weapon switch button just before he's about to put it in. And as you can see, it glitches the ball. It drops the ball you are currently putting in and it puts in another one. And as you can see, if you look at the percentage, it's still going up. Now, I think it's, I kind of screwed it up here. I picked it up too quick. Give it a couple of seconds and then pick it up. Like, count. So, once you put it in, count like one pick. One pick. Like that. And, you know, it just gives that a bit of a timing. You don't want to be picking it up too quick because the game realizes, oh, he's already put it in. And it just disappears from your hand. So, give it like a second or so and then pick the ball up again. Now, as you can see, you just carry on like normal, kill everything. Now, if because as you can see, the beam of light. Just give it a couple of seconds and there you go. There's a beam of light. It is shining over here. Now there's two minotaurs. Kill both the minotaurs. Once both the minotaurs are killed, you then want to kill the champion that is waiting for you. Like in my case, it was a freaking barrier champion. And yes, I had really bad armor on right now, so I had no reload speed. I had nothing. I had about eight resilience or something like But yeah, you kill the champion once you've killed the champion just finish him off up oh, there we are there's a finisher that's a new finisher for you which is pretty nifty and uh, the bloom is always just sat here in like this little like plant thing uh it sucks everything up you pick up the bloom once you picked up the bloom kill all the enemies like again i'm always stuck because there's blockers everywhere but you just re um oh yeah you could also drop the bloom down you don't need to keep picking up so if you're in a bit of a pinch and you need to kill enemies you can't drop it down and just kill whatever enemies you need to and then pick it back up I wouldn't leave it on the ground for more than a couple of seconds uh, just in case it despawns but remember just position yourself at the thing at the bank so you're not getting shot in the back like I was and just yeah press square and then that guy pissed you off that guy messed you up completely and that's basically how you ball glitch your way into a heroic public event yeah so yeah guys, I'm going to leave you with the gameplay over here. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you leave a like, make sure you subscribe. I'll be putting more of these tips up on how to do certain glitches or how to make a certain thing easier. For example, the prismatic recaster, I might be putting up a guide on how to, you know, level that up really, really quickly. And, but until then guys, I will see you in the next stream or the next video. 
So I'll leave you with the rest of the gameplay and enjoy us getting to heroic and miserably fail a guy. Yeah.